What's going on folks? This is Wayne Mini Gaming here coming at you with a how-to video on the OBS Studios on your MacBook M1. Do let's get into the video. Uh, first I'm going to show you how to install OBS Studios. You go to their website. For me, I just download Mac OS. This is for specifically Mac OS M1 users. Click your download, you install and everything. As you notice, I'm playing that song, but you can't hear it because for some reason, I guess on the Mac OS, they don't have audio catcher on the desktop. So I had to do my research and find out that there's some apps you have to download to, to achieve that. So one of the apps I'm using, it's called uh, Ground Control Cube from this website, Ginger Audio. Yeah email address click download wait for your email address which I got mine right here once that's done um, you can either download like I said ground control uh, ground control Q which I'm using or the other ones and uh, click download and wait for it to finish all right, once it's finished, click this. Sorry, this is like take two of me doing this. Do the agreements, install, yada, yada, yada. All right, there you go, you 80% finish. So from here, the only thing you have to do is select this, make sure this is set on ground control uh, channel two, which I use, and the output, you will use whatever you listening to you, um, listen to just up through. So I'm using my headphones, so I'm clicking the headphones. Next thing you need to do is go to settings, settings preference uh, sound go to output and look for ground control 2 and should automatically go through it so as you, as you can see it's playing the music but you can't hear it just or you can't hear it. I forgot yep you can hear it so next I wanted to show you how to what's my recording settings I'm using for my M1 so I'll go to output, advanced, record. I check uh, audio track one and two. MP4, the bit right I'm using is 22,500. Usually I can go to uh, 40,000, but for now I'm just using 2,500, uh, 22,500. So also, you go to audio, you click on desktop audio, which I'm using the ground control channel too. And then your microphone, you can just uh, use whatever you're using to speak through. You don't have to, uh... yeah, on here, you don't have to mess with the input, just the output. And that's about it. So I appreciate everyone watching. This is Wayne Minute Gaming and I'm out.